Hey, hey, Oli Hoopa. So I'm here, I just, um, we get these, it's just, it's just like a magazine. This is one of the grocery stores here in Sweden, and I think this is kind of cool. I think they send them out, like, I don't know if it's once a month or whatnot. Um, if you're a member, like, you, Coop is a co-op, so you pay, um, it's 100 kroners, which is like 10, $10-ish, $10 um, to be a member per year. And with the membership, you get, like, the magazine, and you get the um, discounts and, and, and like, uh, rebates and stuff like that, if you're a member. And uh, I just figured I'd show you one of the magazines that they send out um, once a month. This is a February edition, 2021. And it says uh, um, winter food, warm winter food to, like have for different it's like recipes and like ch just talks and um there's a crossword puzzle in here and everything so i figured we could, i could just like kind of go through it and show you what it looks like and here it says mirror smock which is mere ta more taste um so i figured we could flip through and i just show you what it would what it looks like so of course you've got your ads um for like i guess yeah this kind of like creamy, lotiony set and everything like that, um, and this is your uh, index for here. Here's some little talking here that they're talking about here. Here's another ad for a new, fresh, um, full corn roasted bread. Uh, here they're talking about some uh, some smoothies. Let's see. I'm gonna try to read it and. Try to read it and translate it for you. So this is the Lila. It's uh, mixed uh, two deciliters of oats and a uh, um, and uh, some frozen berries and some uh, spinach and half a banana, half avocado and honey. Um, of course, taste it and then you can press um, some lime into it too. Ganska it, which is kind of a lot of lime, and uh, blend it all. So that is your Lila smoothie here. And then you've got your uh, green smoothie, which is uh, two deciliters of apple juice with uh, grown coal, which is uh, co or, uh, what the hell is grown coal in sweet in English? Green cabbage, I guess, uh, and spinach, and avocado. The, uh, one avocado, one deciliter of frozen peas, um, a, um, a cut apple, and then pressed lime into it and some chopped uh, ingefara and blend that. You have a ghoul smoothie. And I'm sorry to all the Swedish people if I'm like butchering this stuff. I'm just trying to translate it a little for the American people who are looking. Oh, and I told you here about the, um, what you can do here too, what you can have with it. The ghoul smoothie is, uh, it says TX, so example, one and a half deciliters of frozen mango, one deciliter apple juice, one deciliter of oats, a half a banana, a half of misk of chiffron. Uh, misk is a mothwid, which is like a, a small, like a teaspoon, I guess. Um, and half uh, a teahwid, which is a tablespoon of uh, chopped uh, gurkmeya, um, chopped uh, turmeric. And then add to taste uh, pressed, uh, squeezed uh, lemon juice or lemon. And then they talk about like banana glass has become popular, um, which is uh, like banana ice cream where you don't use any um, dairy product. Um, and let's see what they're talking about hummus here and stuff like that. And here's like a, a, a recipe for quick uh, snaba scones, which is like quick scones. Blend uh, six deciliters of Vita Mio, I'm um, sorry, um, white flour, four um, uh, tablespoons of, uh, or teaspoons of baking pulver, and a half a teaspoon of salt in a bowl, and then add 75 grams of cold butter and cut into pieces, and then mix it um, with your fingers, and then uh, whip up two and a half deciliters of milk with an egg, blend um, in the bowl, uh, and then um, form them um, on a baking paper, 
and then it says, uh, it doesn't say how, oh yeah, it does. Um, you can add um, some uh, ball, I don't know what that is, to the hood of, I don't know what ball from is, Swedish people, help me out. And then uh, 200, it's 225 uh, degrees Celsius for 15 minutes and then serve with some marmalade. I love scones. Sometimes I do the, um, I'll do like a, you take orange juice and powdered sugar or apple seen juice made the uh, floral soccer in Swedish, mix it together and then drizzle it over the top of the scone and it's like an orange glaze, apple seen smock. It's really good. Uh, here's like some breads. Here they talk about griter, which is like a stew. This is a uh, fisk and salad you are griter, which is like um, fish and um, shelled. Uh, it says shelled animal, but it's like uh, shrimps and mussels and stuff. Uh, stew. Here is I'm gonna butcher this word. Gushapa. I'm not good at this one. Gul sopa. And then uh, I guess this is like a takeout focaccia bread. It's shikachi bread. Okay. Here, let's talk about it. We've got uh, chicken stew with uh, coconut milk and lemongrass. Here is uh, chicken stew with tofu. No, sorry, kimchi stew with tofu and pok choy. That one's probably interesting. Uh, Coco vin blanc, which is like a French stew. Here's some different wines they talk about and what, um, like, different suggestions. Um, do, I have, do they have different suggestions on what to eat? No, they just tell you what the wine tastes like. Oh, yeah, chicken grita, telling you different meals that are, would be good with it, too. The different wines. Here's like an ad for what they're selling, I think, at the store. And here's an advertisement for yogurt smoothies. This is a brand we have here in Skona. Here's a minestrone soup, 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 sorry. And this is talking about these chicks here. Here is a Sunday dinner. Um, mushroom toast with a Parmesan cream. Melanese a la Parmesan. I don't know what that is. That looks really good. It looks like eggplant. Here's some more wines. And this is uh, pineapple and mascarpone cream, cream. Italian comfort food. Coffee. They're talking about Turkish yogurt. This is a, this actually sounds pretty good. It's a, a vegan, vigo, sorry, not vegan, vegetarian pie with Turkish yogurt. That looks good. This looks good. I don't eat meat, but this looks good. It's a uh, marijuana and uh, chicken. Let's see. In here. This is like tips. And here is a tomato and linseed with mozzarella. It's a soup. Here we've got, uh, I don't know what these are in English, uh, Jord Soccer Soup Ahmed with uh, Italian uh, pin bread. I don't know what Jord Soccer is in English. Uh, artichoke, sorry, artichoke soup with um, Italian pin bread. And then uh, um, kebab rula with, lin, uh, with a type of bread. Here is a waffle wrap, a uh, hummus bowl with um, uh, like a meat stick, meat spit. And then here's more advertisements and things like that. Halloumi, lin pasta. This I've done before, like on my own, and it's amazing. So this is a popular cake in Sweden, Kodkaka, but now they're telling you to add peanut butter. Kodkaka with Jordnutter. So it's chocolate cake with peanut butter. Excellent. 
lemon drizzle cake. Here's some like coupons and stuff if you remember. And here's some new um, um, carrot tortillas. There's a crossword puzzle. Here's some more recipes. That sounds good. Chai latte and salted caramel. This sounds kind of interesting. It's pea pesto. This is a popular dish here in Sweden. Krop, kakor, med, skret, smer, and uh, whole lingen. It's a um, body, body cake, I guess. Krop, krop and kakor. Something like that. Here's a burger with best of all most and some pickled grunts out there. I'm sure I'm butchering, butchering this stuff in Swedish, so all my Swedish people can correct me. Some more advertisements and things. Here's like this new thing they have. More advertisements. This kind of sounds good too. That sounds good. Marcella curry greeton, which is like, yeah, um, Marcella curry with, uh, it's like a stew, butter chicken stew. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. It talks about how to get the credit card for Coop and points and everything like that. So that is an uh, example of a magazine that you would get once a month if you were a part of them, the Coop grocery store member. I think we became a member only because my husband got like a, when we first moved in, they got like a free become a member. So that's how we became a member typically. We don't shop there. Um, I usually just shop at Eco or Hemp Shop. But yeah, I like the recipes that are in it. It's fun to look at. And you get to read some Swedish and learn some Swedish. Learn more Swedish, which is always fun. I think food was the easiest thing to learn. But yeah, thanks for watching this little uh, magazine video with recipes. Hey, do. This wasn't in the magazine, but I figured I'd just show you something that I made. It's a um, a vegan <coughs> vegan chickpea curry, and I left the chunks of tofu kind of big because I don't eat tofu, but my husband and my son do. Um, that way, they can just have what they want. But it's peas and veggies and coconut milk. And a red Thai curry. And it's I tasted it, it tastes amazing. And then just uh rice. Of course. And it was like super, super easy, quick, uh, it's not too spicy, and it's just a a really nice dish.